going back to the game. The Spikers serve has been an avenue for the up-and-coming stars in men's volleyball to hone their skills. Now to shine the spotlight on them, my co-host, uh, as, as well as Spiker Surf anchor and analyst Zihar Vasho will be putting on her analyst hat this time around for the segment as she shares her list of top hitters to watch out for in the tournament. Or if you haven't already, I suggest that you do because grab it. The names that we're going to mention here are some of the best uh, to watch. Start off first with the PGJC Navy's see Joshua Umandal. And he's someone both you and I yeah. have been really excited about because of what he's shown in the national team in the past. And he has taken us again to the next level here domestically. That's right. I mean, the name Jao Mandal has been there since he was in college for U playing for UST. Yeah. And then he graduated, he played for a, a couple of club teams and then uh, played for the national team as well. But for me, what's interesting um, watching Jao grow, mm -hmm. I guess, parang na push niya yung ceiling eh, yung... Uh, uh, yung, yeah, yung ceiling niya as a player and ako, I'm just so glad, I'm so happy to see him grow as an athlete and here with the team, uh, the PGJC Navy, parang he, he's embracing the role of yeah. the leader in the team. You know, we remember, I think the, the time where he made the most headlines so when he had to take over scoring for the national team mm -hmm. and it feels like mm -hmm. from there, sobrang upward na yung trajectory niya, naging like import sa Bahrain. Uh, now leading the PGJC oh, yeah. Navy. It feels like not only are we seeing him mature uh, appearance wise, because I remember seeing him the first time, medyo parang ba baby talaga. Maybe, eh. maybe parang naman oh, siya ngayon. Oh. Yeah, pero it's different this time, isn't it? Correct. Um, I think that's what separates a good player from a great player is yeah. kapag kulang yung piesa mo sa team. Yeah. And then someone chooses to step up and embracing the role to yeah. become the leader of the team. I think that's what, you know, boosted him to where he is right now. The next player we're going to talk about is a guy that uh, our friend Neil Flores says, a paraging galit kapag nag warm up. Ito si Isay Marasigan yes. has been one of the go-to guys of Signal, the team captain. What do you have to say about it? Um, Signal, uh, as we both discussed earlier also, Signal kasi a very deep uh, bench. Everybody can, you know, provide whatever, how many points they need for a game. But I think with Isay kasi, um, syempre, aside from like the Marquez Pejo, he's been the consistent go-to guy yeah. of Signal. And talagang, again, it's about embracing the role. So just like Jao Mandal, he's been embracing the role as the team captain, as the leader of the team. And you know, he's been steadily there, you know, putting, uh, uh, keeping everybody close to the ground and you know, making sure that Signal stays on top. Here's a guy that I have not had the chance to cover yet, and uh, I think not? you have. It was Obed Mukaba. <laughs> yes. Tell us about. Tell me about him because oh I want to know more about him. Okay, so si Obed Mukaba, he's the import uh, of the NU squad, and I think he's uh, relatively young. Um, you can see in his ano, in his movements, sa parang medyo bata pa siya. He's one of, if not the tallest of the team, yeah. uh, players in the team. Pero parang nagginagamay pa niya yung yung katawan niya kasi ang laki, laki niya and just like that um, I remember I covered that game and I was like wow for him to like be smart and anticipate the kinds of balls coming to their side of the court and again it's the potential eh. it's there and nakikita natin he's reaching it he's pushing it further and napaka raw talaga no? it is so when, it is when you so look, sobrang exciting talaga pa when you look at these three guys uh, of course uh, syempre the one that we're not familiar with a lot is uh, Obed Mukaba mm -hmm. so I want to concentrate on him but when mm -hmm. you look at Obed Mukaba you it feels like you're talking about like you see the potential, but he's not even close to it yet. He's not there yet. Um, if you check out his points um, in their previous three games, six points versus VNS, five points versus Santa Rosa, but 17 points in the game that I covered against Navy. Parang ha, mapapaisip ka, like what else can he do in the future, especially when he's ripe. You know, as a as an athlete for the NU squad, and you know maybe for the national team. Well, we'll see. You know, we'll, uh, <laughs> well, we're going to mumble through that first. And uh, Z, maraming salamat. Thank you very much Thank for being you. an analyst. Now go back to your anchor duty. Okay. Here. You can catch the action of the Spikers Surf <laughs> every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday on One Sports and One Sports Plus.